Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Node.js. Today we are going to learn about the export functionality. Export CSV in Node.js. Those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. So let's get started. How we are going to proceed with the exporting a CSV file using the Node.js. So here you can see that first of all, we have to create the routes. So I have created the route export with the index controller export. So you can see that. So here, first of all, I'm getting all the users related data. Then I'm making the heading. Then new book. Okay. Then convert JSON to sheet part. And the origin should be A2. Skip the header. True. Then sheet add to a AOA. This is the function of the XLS. Then book append with this one. Okay. Then write the files into the CSV with the help of the type buffer right then we are attaching the csv file with the name of the users.csv okay then we are sending the buffer okay so this is the core part of exporting the csv part right and if you are go and check the xls part you will get all the th things over there all the parameters what they are using okay so if i go and just check the npm i x l s x okay so this is the package that they are using sheet.js okay so if i go and just check this one part like sheet.addoa what exactly it's doing so you will get all the things okay so to process the data add a new row okay so if you want to add a new row you need to add this one sheet to add this one part right next we have book sheet append okay so you will get to know about all this so modifying workbook structure Okay, so this is basically used for modifying the work, workbook structure. So this is append book. This is a workbook. This is a worksheet. And this is a name that the next parameter should be true. So first part should be the workbook, worksheet, and the name of the sheet. Okay, then we have the this one, JSON to sheet. This is very important to convert that part. Okay, converts an array of JS objects to the worksheet. Okay, so this all the table to sheet. If you want table to sheet, converts the DOM table element to a worksheet. Sheet add, adds an array of objects of JS to the existing worksheet. Okay, G sheet to add JSON adds an array of the JS objects to an existing worksheet. This is the exporting part, right? importing. Same thing that we are doing with the importing part. Importing part, there's this one exporting. So all these kind of functions you are going to learn in this XLS documentation. So you will get to know about the why, what, each and every function denotes the values right you can see that okay so by using writing this one you are able to export the csv let's do it so we have a routes that is called export so i have already created the export so i have to write localhost 4000 slash export because it's a get api okay hit it now you can see that users.csv uploaded. Now you can see that. Okay, all the data. And if I go and just check this one, name, email address, and all things are going to be important in the sheet. I think I haven't restarted it. So let me restart again. And let me again hit this one. Pause. Yeah, name is okay. Because previously the name is not correcting one. So it's like uh, you can see that. Okay. So this is how we are able to export the CSV in Node.js. Any doubt, any query in that, let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day.